Welcome back to VKQ Interest in Adventures and another Overgrown Manchild. In today's Overgrown Manchild, we're going to go back to some trading cards. And not just my Pokemon that I've been doing recently, but some movie cards from a movie that I really, really enjoyed. Let's take a look at some Howard the Duck cards. Comment down below if any of you guys have seen the movie. I know I have. I have it. Got it on uh, DVD here. Working on trying to find an old copy of VHS tape for it too. And how many of you guys want to see an updated version of Howard the Duck in the MCU? I would love to see them adapt Howard the Duck to have a bigger role than just these bit parts in the Guardian of the Galaxy series. Alright. I picked this up at a anime convention actually. Ignore the $10 price. I got a discount on it buying a couple different sets of stuff. Alright, let's take a look. We got Alright, I like it. I like it. Put right here on my Pokemon play mat. There. I have a lot of memories of this movie when I was younger. Might not technically have been one that my grandmother should have taken me to see, but she did. I mean, I was like six. <laughs> uh, it's been a hot minute since I've watched this movie, though. I'm going to say, shoot. I don't think I've watched this movie in... I'm going to say like at least 10 years. This one's got a little bit of gum damage on the back. It's alright. So, when you break everything down with the stuff I bought at the anime convention from the vendor at that booth, I think uh, this breaks down to being 5 bucks for the set. 6 bucks, something like that maybe. I don't remember exactly. It's been a minute since I went to that anime convention. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, I think I might go back and watch this movie soon. Sorry about my camera and the focusing issues it's having. <laughs> Count Duckula. That reminds me of the old show. You guys remember Count Duckula, the TV show? It was a cartoon. It was on Nickelodeon, I remember. Uh, it was about a vampire duck who was actually a vegetarian vampire duck. Ooh, scary. <laughs> No more, Mr. Nice Duck. Little Lost Duck. Weird but cute. Wonder if they're going to have a scene where those two end up in bed together, huh? Be a weird card to have. Could that be the chase card for this set? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if this base set has just the base set cards or if I have the stickers too. We're about to find out. I hope it has the stickers too. That'd be a bonus. But even if it's not a base set of this from this movie and the nostalgia that I'm feeling just looking at the scenes from this, complete worth the money that I spent. Oh. 
<laughs> Sorry guys, I'm so quiet right now, just like I said. Nostalgia, remembering the movie. Dr. Destructo. <laughs> okay. I guess we are getting that card. Look at that. Guess there's nothing wrong with the interspecies relationship if they're sentient ducks from outer space. <laughs> uh, okay. Okay, it looks like I'm rolling with just the base deck as this pile is starting to get pretty low. And I do not believe the stickers are in here. So maybe I'm gonna have to go find those. I can't remember how many were in there, like 22? Yeah, here's the last of the set, so definitely not going to have the stickers. Bluey! <laughs> Quack to me, Howard. And can we just take a moment to appreciate the 80s outfit style? That is amazing. I want my HTV. Awesome. And last card is the checklist. Okay. So I'm going to have to keep an eye out for uh, the stickers. That is the Howard the Duck base set movie cards from Tops. I want to say 1986. Yep, 1986. Marvel. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, share, and subscribe.